What are the optimal levels for estradiol, progesterone, testosterone, and DHA for females 65 and above with osteoporosis too? Optimal but... levels? Yeah. Okay, I want to put, I want to dial that in about 35 because that would be an optimal level. They say 28. That's what the American Academy, Academy of Endocrinology said before. You like 35 for all of them across the board? 28 is more ideal. For both testosterone, estradiol, and progesterone? Yeah, testosterone would be above 50, and I don't care about, uh, you get a, a a free and total, I don't care about the free. It's an accurate woman. Don't ever look at a free testosterone and believe it. In women, in men it works, in women it doesn't. Yeah, it's the machine is um, is sexist and misogynist, but that's the way it is. And I like it around 50 or above. Um, I think it's the nanograms per deciliter, but don't hold me to it. Um, <laughs> estradiol above 40 or above. Progesterone. Ideally, about 20, really hard to get there above 10 if you can. And that's for any age, or is that for women in menopause? Women, yeah, you asked for menopause. Don't I know, I was just wondering me. now. Uh, don't trick me. Okay. Yeah. Tricked you.